Hey, this is Andrew Brown, and before we get into Azure AD, I need to point something out. It's not called Azure AD anymore, it's called Microsoft Entre ID. Microsoft decided to change the name of Azure AD. Why? Nobody knows, but I can tell you no customer likes this particular change. Um, somebody who just had a lot of time on their hands over at Microsoft. But we do need to address this. And I need to point out that I'm not refilming all of the content that I made just to change the name because that's crazy. I will at some point when the, when the content is stale, but the content's not stale. They just changed the name on us. Um, but I wanted to just go over that quickly here. So uh, the names here, we have Azure AD is now Microsoft Entre ID. Then the Azure AD tiers is uh, from P1, P2, still P1, P2. The Azure AD external identities is now called Microsoft Entre uh, external identities. If we scroll on down, we have a logo change. So instead of this, which by the way, I really like the old logo. They didn't need to muck with it. But anyway, we have uh, the older ones here. And so this is the new one here. And so there are some name changes here. Azure AD single sign-on is now Microsoft Entre, Entre uh, single sign-on. And we'll go down below here and you can see well, more name changes, okay? So um, anyway, yeah, they renamed it and you know, customers are just gonna take a while to get used to it. I still like calling Azure AD. I know a lot of other people that like still calling it Azure AD, but it's at some point we'll get moved over to it and we're just gonna use both names, okay? Now coming over to uh, the, uh, the portal, I need to show you that if you type in Azure AD, it's still going to pull up Microsoft Entre ID, okay? Uh, now you don't want Azure AD B2C, which is interesting they didn't rename that. Uh, which is a, it is part of Azure AD kind of in a sense, but it's more for um, if you're building applications and you want to um, have uh, authentication into it. So just understand that there's not consistency all over the place, especially even their documentation, the marketplace still says Azure AD all over the place. Um, even down below, uh, you know, Azure AD notifications. So, you know, there's just gonna be that legacy of Azure AD. But anyway, yeah, what you wanna do is go, go over to Microsoft Entre ID. It all looks the same. It's just some name changes, okay? But yeah, there you go. See you in the next one.